Hey there guys, I'm Hello Japan, and welcome back to the madness that is Wind Waker. So, I think I finally got everything figured out. I think all the settings should be good, the graphics should be great, um, the visuals I mean. I think everything should be running fine. There might be a little bit of slowdown because it is still an emulator, but I think I have everything finalized. I mean, just look at how amazing Link looks. It's awesome. I mean, there is one more step above I could go with anti-aliasing to make every, like, little bumpy, you know, edge of the character models smooth completely, but it just makes my computer run... I mean, it, I mean, it runs it to, like, 25 frames, but I'd rather get almost solid 30 as opposed to 25 and dipping down even further, you know, with, uh, um, you know, with uh, other things. But, uh, but anyway, enough of me rambling. Um... Let's get started with the Wind Temple. Forgot to grab you, friend. <laughs> okay, so let's see. I while I was doing testing, I actually came in this room. I have no idea what I'm doing. So let's see if we can't figure this out. Uh, can we actually? I don't remember the What's the song. Boom, 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 boom. Okay. Okay, so let's see if we can make him fly around, because there are enemies down below. But I believe we can actually control him. Yeah, we can make him fly around. So fly. Okay, just doing a little bit of a test. See how he controls. And can we actually fly into this, or will it push us down? Well, we can go over it, so... Over the gap. Not a big deal. Uh, oh, maybe he can... Can he step on this? Ah, there we go. Awesome. Uh, let's get out of here. And before we fly over there, I'm gonna... Take care of this wizard over here. And that, uh... Whoop, uh what's his face over there? It's been one day since I recorded the last episode, and I can't remember this guy's name. <laughs> and I fought these yesterday. Uh, well, whatever your name is, I don't remember. Let's, uh, take care of you. Come on. There we go. And awesome. Okay, and I think we can use bombs to carry this. Uh, let's actually get the items we need out first. Uh, well, I guess for now we can just do that and get this out. <laughs> Whoops, didn't mean to do that. I think this should take care of it. We'll find out. Awesome. Bit of a double tune there, that was kind of weird. Uh, but what you need for... Just to be safe. Okay, there's nothing, nothing too much of interest there. Uh, to what, what, or what, to what do you want to do? To what you do, is you put on your iron boots. Are they called? What are they called in this game? Uh, iron boots. Are they called iron boots in the Ocarina of Time? I don't remember what they were called in Ocarina of Time. I think they might have just been iron boots. For some reason, I just feel like they're called ton boots or something. I don't remember though. It's been so long since I played Ocarina of Time. And you just want to use our little link friend to glide all the way across. Uh, and speaking of Ocarina of Time, I, uh, I have a 3DS, and my brother lent me uh, the 3D Ocarina of Time, you know, Ocar Ocarina of Time 3DS. And it's actually pretty cool. You know, at first I, I didn't want to play it with uh, the uh, there's those weird textured statues again because of the emula emulator, but um, I didn't want to play it with uh, the 3D effect on. But after a while, after I finished. Uh, the first temple, I was like, you know what, this isn't that bad. It's actually pretty cool. Let's go ahead and get these arrows out. Okay. Yeah, but I was pl I beat Goma, you know, I, I did the whole first temple, and after I after I did that and, you know, made my way out of the, uh, out of Kakariko Village, 
Or Coke, not Kakariko. Ka but Kakariko is the. Whoa. Kokiri Forest. The Kokiri Forest, yeah. Kokiri Village. After I made it out of there, I, um. Turned on the 3D, and, uh. I have to say, it is pretty cool. It is pretty neat. Oh, this guy can't make me fly. Shoot. <laughs> Okay. Now, what was the point of that? Is there uh, something to ah? Is there something to grab somewhere? I'm not too sure. You know, what? you come here. I'm gonna take a look at this. Okay, let's go over here. What's the point of these? I don't, I, don't, I don't get it. Oh! Link! I don't think I have the power to aid you much, Link. But I can at least plant a tree here in the soft soil. If you conduct me, I can use A to sow seeds. Use your Wind Waker to conduct me. Okay, cool. Well, that's good to know. I was also going to ask you guys, uh... I'm probably gonna have recorded a bunch of episodes, you know, after uh, after I already asked this question. But what do you think of the new intro? I kind of wanted something a little bit different, you know, not uh, not not your normal, just like hey there guys, welcome back to this. I wanted like I don't know, like, I kind of like the the madness that is. Like it's kind of kind of a neat thing. Okay, so what do we do here? That was kind of retarded. <laughs> what was the point of that? Like, sure, I guess it's just a way to show you the mechanic of that, but it seemed kind of dumb. Kind of pointless. Okay. Uh, we've got down there just solid ground. You know, we're actually going to use my car here. No, 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 I didn't do that. Uh, we're going to use him and fly around and plant, uh, plant, plant trees there, because I know what item we get in this temple. And we're actually going to need the trees there, so we might as well do it now. And I wonder if we'll actually, uh... Open up the door for us when we do this. You know, and I've been considering uh, what I'm going to start doing. I think is uh, play one Zelda game and then play another Zelda game. I don't know though. I mean, there's this the issue with Zelda games is that there's such a huge time sink. And while I'm in school, it'll be so much easier just to play indie games that are really short. Call me lazy. Call me what you will, but you know, there's just something about a. Uh, Something about indie games that attracts me to them. I figured that would happen. Oh shoot! Really? Where are the balls is he now? Is he gonna be in the very beginning again? Oh shoot! Uh, well, you know what? Hang on. Let's let's continue on first. This might be one of these uh, things where we have to follow the you know the path that we've unlocked before we can actually uh, rescue him. Oh, I remember this area. This is actually. Where is he? Oh, there he is. Oh, yeah, I, I do remember this. This is kind of neat. Yeah, I see. I see. You. Go. Oh, one rupee. Thanks. <laughs> Whoa, did not mean to do that, but sure. Oh, pinata. Sweet. Okay. Uh so how do we get you out of there? Link! The stone that blocks the entrance seems extremely heavy. The only way you can move it, Link is if you were to become as heavy as the great Deku Tree himself. Uh, if only the great Deku Tree were here right now. Well. I think, well, I mean, I know I have, I know I have these boots, but... Will that really... Will that really do it? Whoa. Yeah, see, like, it, it doesn't do anything right now. Okay. So, uh, what I believe is we need the item from this area, or from this temple. I get out of here, you bitch. Uh, need the item from this temple, and we need to use those, you know, 
alongside the uh, iron boots. Shoot. Man, these guys are just annoying. Yo. And this is... Shoot, this is the area down there. Oh wait, no it's not. This is a different area. Huh. Whoa, get out of there. This is a different area. Get off me, you little bastard! Uh, ice arrows, ice arrows, ice arrows. Whoop! Come on. Nice. Awesome. Okay, floor master, you are no more. What is it? There's a floor master, and then there's is there ceiling masters too? I think so. I don't know if they're called ceiling masters. <laughs> I don't remember what they're called. Whoa! That's annoying. Uh, they're, I don't, I don't know what they're called. They're the guys that come down from the ceiling and grab you and pull you up. They're basically the same thing as floor masters, but, well, opposite. Uh, well, we can't go, uh, use that yet because we need the car. I don't think we can use this either, because we don't have the car. So, how the hell do we get this guy? <laughs> I mean, it's, it's worth a try, but I, I'm... What is that? It's a chest. Key? What are you going to give me? Ah, oh, joy pen. Good. Because I said we need we need these for sure. Okay, don't fall, don't fall. Awesome. Uh, let's go ahead and get the leaf back out. Uh, and we can try this. I mean, I guess I don't think it'll work. Oops. Wrong. It'll just say like, you know, he's not he, he's not here right now, so we can't actually do it. Is there a door under this way? No, there's not. Okay. So how do we <laughs> we rescue this guy? I don't remember. I don't remember. Run, 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 run. Hi. Oh, they're gonna chase me. Oh, no, they're not. Sweet. Oh, man. I really wish I remember how to do this. Oh, you know what? Maybe. Can. Yeah, oh, don't talk to me again. Yes, I know, I know, I know. So we can we can take control of him, but it won't it won't do us any good. See, my my theory was maybe that, and but this won't make a difference either, will it? No. Oops. <laughs> Oops. Did not mean to. Oh, no, go away, go away. Can I fall through the mesh. 
No. Huh. Well, do we have a... Warm button. Oh. Oh, come on. Are my seat... Are my... No way. My, uh... D-pad buttons aren't mapped. Hmm. Well, we can still look at the map this way, can't we? <laughs> no, we can't. Oh my god, this is ridiculous. Why in the world would my... Why would they not be mapped? D-pad, yeah. Up, down, left, right. <laughs> That's crazy! Okay. So. I'll go back. Oh, that's right, we don't have the map yet. And this is why I didn't like this temple, because I couldn't remember it for the life of me, how to how to get around here. Or at least once I got to this spot, I just couldn't figure it out. Uh, maybe we do have to take these guys out. Let's go ahead and replace that. Get our bombs going. Oh, <laughs> maybe I should have done that that soon. That was kind of stupid. Hi! Back here. I want what's inside you. <laughs> Just stay away from me. Anything? Nada. That blows. Okay, well, let's go back here. Let's see what we're doing. <laughs> Shoot! Oh no. Try and get out of here before this thing goes off. Oh! Almost! <laughs> almost got it. Almost. And something else I forgot to mention. Come on, Link. Uh, another thing I forgot to mention is I uh, actually tinkered around with some of the audio settings so if it sounds a little louder, that could be why. I mean, I uh, I took a listen to the few you know past few episodes and they were just seemed too they seemed too quiet so I turned it up a little bit and uh, hopefully you guys don't mind you know, however loud I had it but I think it, I think it was you know, it wasn't too bad. Now, I think he has to be standing on this. I think it will swing back as soon as I... No, it didn't. Oh, nice. So I guess I was going the right way. Get out of here, you whiz robe. Balls, I fell off. Oh, man. Oh, man. I'm guessing... You know what? I have to get arrows out. This guy's gonna be a pain in my dick hole. Oh, oh. <laughs> it doesn't want to let me up there. And uh, same rules as always, even with the new uh, updated graphics look. Oh, what's going on? Even with the new updated graphics look, I'm still going to try and make the episodes uh, anywhere from 20 to 30 minutes long. I actually plan on doing more uh, GameCube LPs you know, now that I have a. Uh, Oh, jeez, and actually a decent understanding of how, uh, a decent understanding of how this program works now. So I've really, <laughs> really sunk a lot of time into this stupid thing. Please, please have some, yeah, I really need, oh, thank god. We still haven't found that magic upgrade yet, because I know there is one. Is there? It's over there. The chest. It's probably rupees. But if we need fudge muffins. But if we need a uh, a key or something, we'll just head back there. Awesome. Awesome. Nope. Oh shoot! <laughs> I didn't mean for that to happen. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Whoop. 
Wiz Rogue, you jerk. We're actually gonna YOLO it. YOLO! Whoosh. Come on, come on. Oh, you were lucky, you jerk. You were so incredibly lucky. You had no idea. If I would have fallen off, you would have been dead. I couldn't think of a good insult. <laughs> okay, so this looks like the right place. Jeez. Makar, I'm sorry, but you have to stay in there for a while. I guess they realized that Makar wasn't uh, too integral of a character to really uh, <laughs> justify getting out of that too soon. Let's go ahead and replace it with that. Because those are actually really useful. I, uh, when I, uh, had the gray screen of death, like, two episodes ago, the, uh, those pots saved me a lot of time, but, you know, stupid me, I guess I didn't unlock the third one, which was closest to the boss door and save before that. <laughs> so, yeah. Lucky, lucky me, I had to play all the way through that again. Um... Let's check this grass first. Good, good, good. Good, good, good. Can I just, like, descend all the way down, or...? Oh, you know what? There's a... chest over here. I want to see what it is. I want to see what you have. Ow. <laughs> oh, come on. Oh, I'm hitting the wrong button, that's why. It's either going to be the map or the compass. More than likely it'll be the map. Oh, compass! Hmm. Did not expect that. Normally you get the compass, I mean the, the map, before you get the, uh... Yeah. The, the compass. And maybe that's what that chest was that I buy. <laughs> I completely bypassed was the, uh... The compass, or the map, I mean. Good shit! St I'm, okay. So I'm used to the, the, the GameCube layout of the buttons. But I'm playing on an Xbox, you know, formatted controller, so the buttons are flipped. So, A on the right and B on the left, like it does on the screen. My A is on the left and my B is on the right, and the X and Y are flipped also, so it's just really annoying to look at that. What the fuck is- oh. <laughs> it's like, what is that? You, know, you can actually cheat this and just put a bomb here and see what's down below. Because I think what they intended for you to do is, uh... Fudge, I don't think you can cheat it then. YOLO! Look at that. Look at- oh god. Uh, arrows. Why'd they say it? <laughs> I don't know why I said it like that. Take care of you! Take care of you! And run like hell! Whoops! And this guy should do it. Okay. Now, we have to... Can I, can I grab this? Can. Okay, so we have to look. We can find a place to put these. The ones that are side by side, so it'd be right... Right there. Okay, cool. Yeah. Grab you and pull you over here. Oh, actually, it has to be over there. Yeah, that makes it a little bit more difficult. It has to be over here because you can't get up here otherwise. You can't get past the spikes on the other side. I guess if you had hacks, you could do it, but we ain't roll like that. No hacks. Me cheat sometimes, but I'm not gonna hack. <laughs> Okay. I believe we put it directly in front of it. We should be able to hover across. Grab it, Link. There you go. Okay, and then stick it right below this. Well, that doesn't make any sense. How are we going to get back up across? Oh, uh, that hurts. Let's just get to the top side first. 
and let's figure out what in the world we're doing. Okay. And get over here. Did you see what I mean? Like, we can't... It'd be impossible to get back out of here. Like, there's no way... Unless I'm being really stupid. Hang on, hang on. I'm being really stupid, aren't I? Maybe be a first, but... <laughs> hang on. I think I figured it out. I'm gonna grab this one over here, and I put it next to it. And get out of the noise. <laughs> get out of the room that's full of noises. Those spikes are really annoying, though. Yeah, this is what you're supposed to do. I'm pretty sure. I hope so. It's the only thing that really makes sense, though. So, reach down here and oh, look in his ear. There we go. Nice. I'm gonna go ahead and equip the leaf real quick, just for safe measures. Me measures. Sweet. There we go. And I got a chest. Probably a key. Yeah. And I'm guessing the next area is going to be the item room. Oh, look at that. And I'm guessing that because it's progression in a Zelda game, I think that's <laughs> I think that would make sense. Unless we go down one more floor, but I think the floor below this is a boss floor. Yep, it's an item room. I think we fight whiz robes in here. Yeah. Oh wow. Big guy. I don't know what he's called though. It's probably not a whiz robe. Because whiz, whiz robes are the small guys. Wow. I really didn't want to fight a dark knight in here. I'm gonna deal with this guy first because he's easier. A little bit easier to take down. Oh great, we got birds on top of it. God. Just wanna kill me, don't they? Did I do it? Did I do it? Oh, yes, I did. Let's get our keys out. Keys. Our arrows. <laughs> what the hell's wrong with me? These are keys. <laughs> ah, you're annoying. How are you? If you're lucky, you can get two hits on them. Sometimes it just doesn't work that way. Ah, get away from me. Oh my god. Bastards. There. Oh. Man. There we go. Nice. And we get the item. This is probably. I was thinking about making a top ten list for Zelda items, because I, I, I have the idea of a top 10 list for my all-time favorite games, and I've actually picked out my games and uh, just kind of sorting through the list to double check and make sure that, uh, that they're actually what I think would be my top 10. But this, <laughs> this item would probably rank pretty high up on the top 10 list of top 10 favorite Zelda items. Not this incarnation, though. I don't care for this one much. This hookshot is really nice, but I prefer the hookshot in Twilight Princess. That's probably my favorite hookshot. Okay, basic hookshot mumbo-jumbo. 
replaces the grappling hook. Grappling hook is basically pointless now, unless you want to swing between places, but as an item, it's kind of useless now. Sorry to say for it. I mean, because I, I really did like the grappling hook. It was pretty cool, but the hook shot is just so much cooler. Uh, and then there's a skull switch. I don't actually know if that's a proper term for it, but it's what call it. Oh, Mountain Dew. Or Diet Mountain Dew. Gotta stay healthy. <laughs> Mm. Before I forget, I'm gonna grab this uh, champion belt. And uh, you know, I'm actually gonna call it quits here. I think it's a good place to stop. Uh, we're about 30 minutes into the video now. You know, maybe a little bit more than 30 minutes. But anyway, I want to thank you guys for watching. I've been Hello Japan. This has been Wind Waker. Why won't you? There we go. <laughs> That's what I want. This episode, we got the hook shot. Made it pr about halfway through the wind te or air temple. Is that what's called air temple? Wind temple? Nah, I don't know. But anyway, we made it about halfway through. Next time, hopefully, we will get close to finishing, if not finished. Uh, you know, depending on how much time we have left, and you know, whatever. But anyway, I don't think you guys have to watch. Why? Wow, what was that? I want to thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys next time. <laughs> see ya.